the city done buggering up? Yes? No? Possibly. Who knows? Who cares right now? I forgot to start the timer. Why is there a timer? Because YouTube won't allow me to upload anything over 12-ish minutes. It may actually be 15. I don't actually know. But now the timer is rolling and I can talk for a little bit. I know it's brilliant. Now what is this? Well, first of all, I'm Lan149. And my actual name is Bellaby for some reason you want to know. But this is a, uh, a video diary. Or more like an audio diary considering. It would be a vlog, but I don't have a camera. So you see the problems there. It'll just be kind of a a log because you know you take away the V because it's not a video. Right. Besides that, um, I don't. I'm doing these for reasons of because I have no particular like. I want to do this because it's interesting to see my opinions change over time. And also, I don't know if for some reason I get popular because of this, it's nice seeing people respond to my various different opinions, I'm going to keep on calling them. But because I haven't exactly done anything particularly interesting right now, um, yeah, I, I can't nothing more to talk about apart from, I don't know, talking some news I'm literally looking at right now. Like, um, according to PC Game News, the PC Gamers thing, this thing, is, um, Apparently exoskeletons will be optional in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare multiplayer. What freaking revolutionary gameplay we got here. What? What? This is... Is this really how slow video gaming news is? That news is that exoskeletons are optional. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. Diablo. You can play Diablo in Minecraft if for some reason you want to play a severely cut down version of Diablo. What? How? How is this news? What? Oh my god. Ugh, Robert Robodoff. You see, I, mean, I feel sorry for games journalists. I mean, this is what they have to do. Oh, this is... what? What? Notch is over being upset. Oh, uh, the Oculus Rift with Notch. <laughs> I don't like the Oculus Rift because Facebook bought it. That's so dumb. Facebook, if they really want to mess with it, then meh, whatevs. But there's things like the Morpheus? I think it's the Morpheus from the PS4 and such. Not really that interesting, really. But it, it's the fact that it's, it, it is news that Nodge got over being upset about the Oculus Rift. What What is... Th I guess I'm even worse, considering I'm literally commentating on the stupid news, but... What else would... would I... <laughs> there is literally going on. No companies have done anything particularly stupid recently. I mean, apart from the obvious stupidity stuff, but everyone's kind of got over their stupidity. So there's no point in commentating, and there's not really anything else I can add to that, apart from the stupid. I don't know. <laughs> it is news that Surgeon Simulator gets an anniversary edition. It, how is that news? I can literally go to the front page of Steam. Anybody who cares about Surgeon Simulator owns Steam and can probably do the same. What is wrong with the world right now? This that's a serious question. More particularly the gaming world, but you know. <laughs> oh god. Uh, there is literally nothing right now. Like, bugger all going on. Wow, that's that's actually a good thing considering most of the, most of the news that comes out of gaming is usually this company screwed up everything or something along those lines. So you know, I, it's actually probably a good thing that there's no news because it means nobody screwed up everything. Wait, what? Hang on, hang on a minute. Oh no, no, I'm I'm blind. It's all good. You're not even know, gonna know what I'm talking about because see my brows right now. Which is probably a good thing considering. Oh yeah, um something I completely forgot to mention in my intro quotation marks is that the gameplay footage in the background is just random bits of gameplay. It has absolutely nothing to do with what I'm talking about. Probably they're just literally random clips. It's basically like that thing that I made that random dumps stupid stuff. Um except I, I talk over it. 
planning to do this like at least like hopefully maybe every day ish but it's not exactly easy considering upload times and stuff like that and also render times I forgot about that uh, you do not understand the amount of work you have to put in for something as stupid as literally just 12 ish minutes of footage it is silly or well, well, not really the amount of work the amount of time it takes because you have to go through rendering the entire thing and then uploading the entire thing and that can take an entire day considering my internet which is not exactly helpful oh god uh, <laughs> out of things to try and talk about right now I went to the, my library on um, Steam and I saw Dark Souls is oh, well, I guess it's from software's it's both stupid names but thing on the, their announcement of the DLC, the first bit of the DLC being released. I'm going to read this out to you. Hopefully those who are listening with brains will be able to realise why this is stupid. As if the web... <laughs> apparently my tongue's retarded as well. That's not part of the description, that's just my tongue's retarded. As if the regular obstacles and enemies and bosses present in Dark Souls TM2 were not enough to cause gamers to cry for their mommies, From Software today unleashes Crown of the Sunken King. <sighs> ah. oh. If you do not see the problem with that, it, that, that literal sentence, as if Dark Souls 2 was not enough to make gamers cry for their mommies, that literally, literally sums up all the problems with Dark Souls 2, ish anyway. It, uh, it's focusing on trying to be a hard game instead of a challenging game, you see? And also the marketing is stupid. Um, that may just be because, I don't know, From for some reason can't be bothered to actually, you know, spend their money on getting people to do these jobs for them instead of just grabbing some random dude off the street and going, your game is hard, so like, write some stuff to make people who like getting hard do dish. That was intended, by the way. Um, it's, it's stupid. Like, why? Why? Like, I don't play Dark Souls because of the difficulty. If anybody did, then I want to be the guy. Would be the most popular game in the universe. But it isn't. You play Dark Souls for the story, the atmosphere, the designs and the tense combat. I don't play it because I die a lot, okay? That doesn't make sense. If I did, I'd be into, like, whipping myself or something, but I'm not. And most people aren't into doing that. Okay? Like... Uh, it's, it's, it's just so stupid. And nobody seems to notice it. Which is the most annoying bit. Which either suggests that nobody cares, or that everybody is actually playing this game because they like to whip themselves. Which is stupid. Uh, I would like to think that I'm not in the majority of wanting to play a game for its story, but apparently I... That's not good. <sighs> Beside that uh, rant, I guess, about something amazingly stupid and irrelevant, I've been playing the, the Fallouts, New Vegas, and... I had the same problems as Fallout 3. Um, everything feels very uninvolving. That's my main problem with it. I, I, I got immersed in the game for a little bit, and then I just sort of hit a point where I was like, no, actually, no. <sighs> I spent a lot of time in Skyrim, not even noticing I was spending a lot of time with Skyrim. Like, apparently I spent about 120 hours playing Skyrim without noticing. That's about the exact same as, as you know, I spent 180 hours in Dark Souls 2. That's, that's, that's a lot. That's a lot of time. And, yeah, with Fallout 3, and it just felt very unimmersive, uninvolving. I wasn't doing much. Nobody seemed to react to what I was doing. Like, let me, let me give you a little, um... Anecdote? Yeah, that's the word. Anecdote about what happened when I was trying to get into New Vegas. Because I, I listened to... Well, yeah, listened to a review by um, Yatsi Croshaw of the game. And he had mentioned at one point that 
you had to pay a robot a bunch of money to get into New Vegas. I was wandering all around the side of New Vegas trying to look for a way to find this door and this robot that I could pay the money to and get into New Vegas, which apparently was my goal. And I couldn't find him. I later found out I needed to go through some place called Freeside or something like that. And then you would find the robot there and he'll shoot somebody and then you pay the money and run off. But when I actually got in, I went in via a different way, via the NCR uh, camp and the monorail. I went up there, murdered one of the dudes in front of the monorail, the other dude ran off, I got on the monorail, hoping whatever new in was in New Vegas was worth murdering one of the members of the NCR and possibly pissing off the entire NCR, or whatever it, it is, it is NCR, isn't it? Not like any NCR or something equally as silly. Eh, irrelevant. But I, I killed the person, went on the monorail, and nobody cared. Like, nobody. Nobody seemed to care that I had murdered my way through them. Like, bunches of people saw. I even went back to the place. I could loot the corpse on the ground. Nobody cared. It's not like I was being super stealthy. I literally walked up to them with the equivalent of a laser machine gun and blasted the heck out of them. Nobody cared. Everything is just so uninvolving. Now I'm about to run out of time. Uh, I literally have a minute left on my counter down there. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to have to stop here. Probably going to put whatever date it is today in the description so that I can remember what date it is today. Actually, it'll probably be out in the title, won't it? Besides, it does not make any difference anymore. Goodbye. I have been Lan149 and I already said goodbye, so I'll say it again. Goodbye!